Hi, I am Mariana Cusa. I live in Perth, Western Australia. On uh, 12 July 2022, I was given a gift. 9010 med bed. Well, I'm a bit skeptical usually. So I said, this body needs some help few problems here and there. I went through all the preparation, I took the photograph and uh, I said, well, let's see what will be. I got to bed, 10.20, lie down, have a deep, deep breath, seven deep breaths, relax. I wanted to be aware, I wanted to feel, I wanted to know, does this really work or is just an opinion or is just somebody telling me that it works? Well, <laughs> well, well, well. After I relaxed, I... Uh, open my mouth and I said 90 10 med bed please scan me I didn't feel anything for a little while and then I start feeling my arms getting heavier and heavier and I feel like they go bigger and and like a vibration here in my palms and I'm thinking, wow, immediately in my mind was maybe I get a gift of healing so I can heal. <laughs> I waited and I wanted to feel and I was thinking to, to have a scan of my brain and every single cell in my brain to be healed, to be regenerated. I wanted to have this clarity to be able to see and uh, the traumas and things that I gone in my life. I'm originally from Romania and I was in prison, tortured, raped and other things that I gone through cancelling and I'm cleared yet I wanted to be free and I wanted to have this joy in my life. Instead of going in the brain, I start feeling on my gums all around, especially on my right gum, right on the bottom there. Something was working, working, working. And almost like I felt a, a, an interesting taste in my mouth. And I'm thinking, is that that it works? Does it work? And I, I try to identify, is it a tingling? Is it a pain? What is actually there? Uh, it wasn't very hot and after a while I focused that I wanted to, to really work. I asked to, to work and heal my legs, the varicose vein, the swelling, especially the left leg is very, very painful. And uh, well, it's middle of winter here and it was cold and I asked to, to have a warm heat. I didn't feel heat, yet I didn't didn't feel cold anymore. So I tried to identify the feelings and a light, almost like swimming in blue and green, like Aureola Boreal. <laughs> uh, it was very interesting. And a sense of peacefulness came and I tried to be more aware the cat we have a little cat and the cat just go ma ma <laughs> didn't come inside and I had to go and let her out then I came back and started again at 9010 med bed please scan me and uh, wanted to, to, to go back into the aureola boreal and this color and I couldn't go back in there yet I I felt almost like a, a lift in with me i can't remember when i fell asleep um, 
and in the night I felt the cat coming in the room and went on her bed. So in the morning I woke up by the doorbell almost 8 o'clock. Usually I wake up around 4.35 o'clock to, to go to the bathroom, but this time I haven't. I woke up and I had like a pressure in my head and almost a dizziness. Um, I came out and I'm thinking, I'm trying to verify if, I'm, <laughs> if the healing happened. And that pressure, it was funny pressure in both sides of my head and here for a while and during the day I tried to remember I had some dreams uh, very significant dreams uh, with a big black dog that became friendly it was an interesting day on the 13 on the 14 I start feeling uh, a bit better in the sense that I, I had more clarity and like I felt more aware of things around me. The biggest um, surprise was on the 14th in the afternoon I went shopping. And, you know, when you go shopping to grocery, you go there, 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 everywhere. You try to make quickly, quickly the, the, the shops, because the shopping, because uh, my husband is paralyzed, suffering multiple sclerosis. So I had a very short time. And uh, <laughs> in this time, the radio uh, in the shopping center was uh, playing uh, a song that I know, American Pie, and take my shave into the lady. And I start just moving my body, and this vivaciousness start over me, even though I was aware of the 20% increase from the, uh, the week before of all the grocery and my first impression, first thing, uh, things was, do I worry? And then somehow I, I didn't worry. I knew that things will work out, even with our pension, things will work out. But I can't understand where that uh, feeling came from. So I start uh, just continuing shopping and I start dancing, you know, like I was catching and dancing around. <laughs> It was so strange because I can't remember when I was happy in the shop and dancing and moving and people were looking and smiling at me. I smiling, I was smiling back. I don't think that anyone could be around me without smiling. So that was my day. That was my 14th day. And on the 15th day, is 15 when I am recording this. I had such a busy, busy schedule, so many meetings, one after the other, reparation, things. It's evening here and I'm still vivacious and I can say that I have no more pain, headache. Um, my left leg, I still feel heavy and uh, the varicose veins are still there and the swelling is there. There are other parts of my body that needs uh, attention, yet... Oh, Oliver, I can tell you, man, everything that is good comes from God. And you are being an instrument of goodness. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And I would really, really, really love to be part of the further research and to see To see where I, uh, I'm gonna get and to, to show and to talk to other people as well. Already I, I spoke with a few other people that are interested and wanting to know, wanting to, to find how extraordinary quantum physics can be and how we can spread the love. Thank you, Oliver. And thank you, Felician, and thank you. Thank you, thank you the community of people that want to transform the world one quantum physic healing at a time. Thank you.